Hi, I'm Michael Biggs, the great guy for OntarioWineReview.com, and welcome to day four of Sparkling Wine Week. Today we're going to be looking at the Chateau de Charme non-vintage brew traditional method. And I'm telling you, this is one wine that you're going to love, especially for the price. It's the kind of wine that you could drink every day. Well, maybe that seems a little decadent. Let's say every second day. I'll get to the price in just a minute. But what you have here is a wine that is totally fruit-driven fruit on the nose. Absolutely lovely aromas, along with a nice bready and biscuitiness that follows along. And let me tell you something. Traditional sparkling wine fans know that that bready and biscuitiness is definitely something you want in your uh, traditional method sparkling wines. The other thing that you get here is a palate that's really dominated by apple and citrus. It's lots of fun and there's also a little bit of sweetness and the acidity that cuts it so that it's not overly sweet, it's not cloying in the mouth. The acidity cuts that sweetness and makes it very lovely and, and palate friendly. But what I really love about this wine is the one-two punch of apple. You get a little Granny Smith and you get a little Mac apple. So you get both of those thrown in and it's like a little fight in the mouth. It's really absolutely lovely. Price on this one is $22.95 and I give it 90 points. That's the Shadow de Charme non-vintage brute traditional method. I'm Michael Pincus, the great guy for OntarioWineReview.com. Join me again tomorrow when we'll look at another great bottle of Ontario wine, sparkling wine, for the holidays.